Hey guys, welcome back to WP Event Manager and we have a bit of customization video for you today. So the topic is how to change the default event listing view that we view in our event listing page in the front end side. What I mean by that, let's open the front end side and we will go to this events page. So as you can see by default it's the grid layout or box layout that we would like to call. So we can change the default layout. Uh, by including a short code or modifying a parameter okay so let's open this page in a new tab and we will edit that in the wordpress editor okay so the short code for event listing page is just events so the way or the easiest way to customize the default layout is including layout dot type or dash type then we can define three type of uh, layout over here. First one is box that we are viewing right now over here. Second one is line or the list that, that we can view like this. And third one is calendar layout. So the calendar layout is available when you install WP Event Manager's calendar add-on onto the website. So let's say we wanna see the line uh, layout by default for the events listing page. So let's update this page, reload it and we will have the line layout page over here you will notice that the layout selector over here is gone since we supplied and layout type over here in this uh, parameter or this short code that now shows the line layout by default or the list layout okay so we can change it to box and that will bring back the grid without the layout selector see the layout selector is gone but the box layout or the grid layout is over here. I cannot really show you the calendar layout since we don't have the calendar plugin installed in this website right up now. So if we type in calendar and update our page, it will show the calendar over here. Since we do not have the calendar layer calendar add-on installed in this website, we cannot show off the feature. But you have the idea like how to change the default layout uh, view over here using the shortcode parameter. So this is not only uh, the only way to change it. There is a JavaScript way. There is a knowledge base link that I will provide in the description. You can check it out as well. So the JavaScript way is setting a variable called layout and then setting the parameter as line layout, calendar layout or box layout, set it to local storage. What I mean by that, you can check our knowledge base, but I'm not gonna show that off in this video. Maybe I will make an separate video about how to change the default event uh, listing page layout using J javascript but in my opinion using the layout type parameter with the shortcode is pretty easy and convenient for everyone so come join me in our next video where we will have something else for you and we will talk more about wp event manager until then i'm sharad saying goodbye thank you very much for watching and i'll catch you in the next video.